Hello everyone, Jim Hart, JP, and today uh, doing a video on the storyline of Abdelin on Final Fantasy XI. So, previous video they were introduced Ingrid, which is a white mage character, and here's another one. So after that part, uh, Herbert will bring someone such questionable more character to the assembly. I won't talk after this. So. Well, they're talking bad about me. Well, in one from a foreign land, meaning me. Ingrid, here we go. She's listening. You seem to have won over the hearts of the nobles. Too. I think, actually, because she's coming from another as well, so it must be her instead, not me, actually. Take a brief moment and listen away from the eyes. He's actually human, but he's under a curse. So they're trying to get the white mage, I guess the other white mage, they, their own white mage couldn't help them to break the curse, so they're gonna, they brought a foreign white mage. She's known for everything she's done, I guess, in her uh, homeland. Assuming that she can come and break the curse, which is Ingrid, the white mage. Yep, that's true. I'm not no willing for ignorance. Oh my dear Sonia, you seem to have quite the opinion of our emetic friend. <laughs> Pity Fredo to the rest of Anandio. I do not wish to speak ill of you, but the situation is not simple. Unless you forget, Arcilla was also able to hear Yanez's voice. Kevin comes back and honey, you appear to have some allies within you. Oh. 
out there listening to the whole combo. The real cow will come right out to these door. It looks like she's kind of against me, but um, yeah, she's analyzing the whole situation. She's not dumb. I heard all I need to let us, and you really are. She's gonna make an entrance. I have returned from the Midlands and I fear everyone is already assembled. In this pen with the pleasant area show me up to Janet. <coughs> he's right in bed. I mean he's right in bed. Far be it from me to doubt one of my own order but how much can you tell such a simple gesture? I must confess I'm surprised at your doubt I speak only for the goddess guys mean tell me that you doubt her wisdom. I think she's a BS or two, but it's she's funny. Forgive me, it's all my words seem present, Edbert. Back to the matter at hand. Yeah, they know that. Ingrid, yes, adventure. Has Janus spoken to you? I think I can only hear him talk. He says this is in fact the curse of the founder king, and what lies have you for contradicting me? Oh man, she's stuck up too. So it is after all. All your mind changes on everyone like leaf upon a breeze. Not five minutes ago you were singing a different tune. You were spying on us from outside the door? Hmm, I never took you for one who was only here what he wants to. <laughs> he, she's already going off on him, on Herbert. That is not the case at all, just... What do you say? There's no need to break the curse. Silence, outsider, you have no place interjecting your opinion into this dialogue. Your only job is to tell us what he is saying. It matters not who placed his curse upon Yana. Only a grand ritual of purging will be able to rid such a terrible affliction. Unfortunately. Unfortunately what, Ingrid? Such a progression requires materials that I do not have on hand. Vanity only exists thanks to the blessings of eight crystals to penetrate darkness. We need vessels wrapped in the power of seven other types. Earth, fire, I mean earth, water, fire, and wind for me. I have on hand thunder and ice. And what exactly would suffice? It must be a thing better than to a holy glow, let me think. Yes, a piece of stone will touch by the light of dawn. Holy water untented by impurity. Ingrid, a flame has gone extinguished for seven years. The wings of the weather vane that has stood the test of time. Requires each of those four things. And of course, we have someone who is more than willing to serve us as our errand girl. Damn. Is that not right? Return here once you have appropriate 
items and I will begin the ritual. Until that time I shall make preparation. They hate her. <laughs> this girl has some nerve. I would ask you to look after Arcella. And I need not to tell you that she's always run head, head first into danger. Alright you guys, I think that is definitely it. That's the sister of the one that's cursed. She's a queen. Or princess. More like queen though. Arcella, you guys, good to see you here. She is the main character in uh, Ardenland. It came as soon as I heard that Ingrid was to examine my brother. But since everyone's already left, how did it ritual go? Tell her about the punching. She's probably gonna end up going, going with me. They're going to perform a purging ritual. I so Ingrid feels as it curse after all, but not the founder team. What will you say to her? Tell her about the curse and tell her that Yana's voice. Okay, so we did that. Um, what? What could it mean that his voice falter? What will you say to her? Tell her about the curse. So, Arcella. My brother began to show symptoms right after the call went out of adventures from the middle land. It started as simple ration. He said it might have been something he picked up in the forest. There he goes, you guys. That's, that's her brother when, when he's not, you know, when he wasn't cursed. That's what he looked like. But now he's cursed. He looked like a little, like a little plant walking with vines. I still need to know what those are called because it is a race in this uh, expansion. He was still on human form talking with me just as he had when we were younger. I can still hear his voice. There he goes and then slowly he turned into what we used to see him as today eventually losing all his power and speech. Tantika, you were able to communicate with him telepathically now. Does that mean the curse is still progressing? That isn't the end. My, oh, they're called leaf, uh, Leafykin or Leafkins for good. Yeah, they're called Leafkins. Might he turn into a Leafkin for good? You're too kind to me and you're right, it would not do for me to sit here and stew. You're going to help him find the materials needed to this, for this purging. And let me come with you and I'll go anything to see my brother hold him. Just let me know whenever you need. And I believe that's it. Yep. Alright you guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Take care.